I'm gonna show you guys how I made my delicious fruit roll-up snacks. So we're gonna need a uh, watermelon. I just sliced my watermelon or cut my watermelon in half. And I'm just going to um, slice the watermelon, slice down on the watermelon. And as you can see, it was kind of hard. I needed a um, sharper knife, but I'm just going to slice down. I'm just going to um, slice the watermelon all the way down. And I'm just going to be cutting the watermelon into um, chunks. And if you guys want, you could um, get like little popsicle sticks and put that in your watermelon. Or like a stick to put in your watermelon. So it could be like a, um, a, pop, uh, a popsicle. Or you could just do what I did. I did it without the um, uh, without the popsicle stick. But yeah, I'm just going to slice it down the long way. And I'm just going to um, turn my watermelon to the other side and do um, like medium sized chunks. And I'm just going to be going all the way um, uh, through the watermelon. And we'll be using, we'll mostly uh, be using the middle part of the watermelon. Because those are like the chunks that we're going to um, wrap the fruit roll up around. But with the remaining watermelon, you guys can just eat it or make an agua fresca. But this is how my watermelon looks. I'm just going to set my watermelon to the side. And in my measuring cup, I'm just going to add some tahin, I mean chamoy, into my measuring cup. And I'm also going to be using some uh, tahin. I'm just going to sprinkle that in the plate so that it's easier to, um, to add to the watermelon. And then I'm just going to be using some regular fruit roll-ups. I'm just uh, going to be using the flavors strawberry, blue raspberry, and tropical tie-dye. But those are just the um, three flavors that come in this pack. But yeah, I'm just going to start unwrapping the fruit roll-ups. And these uh, fruit roll-ups also have like tattoos on them. You guys can get any fruit roll-ups that you want. But I just got these. And they have like tongue tattoos, which is really um, nice. But um, never set uh, your fruit roll-up on your plate. Because that's not a good idea. It'll just stick to your plate. But um, I'm just going to take my watermelon. As you see there, the fruit roll-up was sticking to the plate. But I got it up. But I'm just going to take my watermelon. And it's kind of, um, it's a little bit hard because the watermelon, uh, well, like, it's, the watermelon's, like, slippery, uh, but, yeah, I just tied it around as tight as I could, and, yeah, I just make sure it was fully covered with the fruit roll-up, and I'm just going to be, um, as you can see, it's hard never set it on the plate because it's like very sticky so yeah i'm just going to be adding some of my chamoy to my plate um so i can roll my fruit roll up in the chamoy um which is a easy way to do it but as you see the fruit roll up did not want to stick to the watermelon but yeah i'm just going to roll uh, my my watermelon in the chamoy until it's covered and then I'm going to place it in the tahine but if you guys don't want your um you guys can like either do it like this or like sprinkle the tahine on the watermelon which is better because um 
it was a little too much tahini. But yeah, you guys could just sprinkle the tahini as much as tahini you want on there instead of just adding it into all of the tahini. But yeah, I'm just going to cover it with tahini. And this snack was so delicious. You guys really need to try this. It really was delicious. And it was um, just an easy, delicious summer snack. This is how the first one looked. And then I'm just going to show you guys me doing another one with a different flavor. I'm just going to be using the tropical tie-dye um, tie fruit roll-up. But yeah, I'm just going to... Um, Remove the paper from the candy. And this this is a perfect snack for the summer. It's just so delicious. Um, from the chamoy tahini and the candy. Just from everything. And then um, it's just refreshing. But yeah, it's refreshing for a um, hot day. But I hope you guys try this. This is a really good um, recipe or like idea snack idea but yeah i'm just going to roll it in the fruit roll up making sure i cover all of the watermelon but i'm just going to add the fruit roll up on there as tight as i can and um, I'm just going to dip it into the chamoy, and I'm just going to repeat the same process. But yeah, I'm going to add it to the chamoy, and then I'm going to sprinkle over um, some tahini. But yeah, tahini and chamoy is so delicious um, for this recipe, but yeah. And it's just delicious overall. But this is the second fruit roll up. And I just sprinkled over some limon. And this is so delicious. I hope you guys try this recipe. Make sure you guys subscribe. Give me a thumbs up. Make sure you guys are following me on Instagram and TikTok. And yeah. I hope you guys make this. Because this is a really delicious summer snack idea. And it's very refreshing. But yeah. This is how it turned out. This is how it looked. It looks so delicious and it was so delicious but yeah don't forget to subscribe and give me a thumbs up adios